All right, time to test the 96 amp power uh, headway battery pack using the PCB bus bars, right? So well, how we have it wired here is with four two gauge wires uh, spread out evenly here. Uh, and we're gonna load it up with as much as 800 amps, depending on where the cells sag below 12 volts. Um, and then uh, we're gonna have it recorded right here with the thermal camera. So let's start that recording right now. And then load up the loads. Here, we're gonna measure that. Okay, so 357, 460, 600, which one is it? Yeah, these cells are uh, okay. How about that? Let's see if that'll do it. So 460 amps, and the cells are at 12.12. Yeah, these cells are struggling to get above 500. Let's see here. So 500, and it falls below. See that? It falls below 12. Okay, so yeah, every row here could do about 50 amps staying above 12 volts, right? So if you multiply that by the... Uh, all the cells across this uh, pack, then you get about 600 amps, which is what we saw, about 600 amps. After that, it falls below 12 volts, which is not very usable for any other 12 volt uh, appliances or you know devices, either in the audio world or in this case, uh, inverters, right? So now let me charge this and then do a test, a continuous test, so we can show the heat pattern uh in the bus bars right maybe something at like 400 or 300 amps or something like that and then uh we'll leave it there for i don't know five ten minutes however much this battery will support all right i'm gonna start recording and i'm gonna start the test oh we need more than that right Right, 383 amps. All right, so there we go, 2.12.7. Let's check 
how even this is distributed. Let's see. So 135 on the first one, 135 on the second one, 49 on this third one, and 72 on this last one. So these ones are getting more, these ones are getting a bit less. We'll see if that shows up in the thermal camera. See the temperatures obviously on these ones that were uh, below 100 amps are low these are about 115 and these ones are about at 115 same as over there 115 degrees so that's how hot they get if you're removing about 400 amps continuous uh, if you use more than four wires like this setup here, then this will run cooler, obviously, right? Um, because then you will share the amperage through the entire uh, battery pack, right? So there you go. Definitely able to do a thousand amps this bus bar, but the battery itself can only do about 600 amps for about 30 seconds. And then after that, it kind of quits the uh headways are pretty cool they're pretty powerful but not as powerful as some of the other ones uh you know the lev 60s for example where a single cell could do 600 amps for like 20 seconds right uh this one requires that much bigger of a setup here <laughs> 